Alright guys, so that concludes our playing lesson. We played 18 here, the par 5. I think we all walked away with 5s or 6s. Uh, we did a lot with 11, with some hazards, and course management on some bad shots, some shots around the green. Uh, I think the biggest takeaway was probably just visually seeing the holes differently. You know, kind of turning what we might see as a bear of a hole into a little bit easier if we look at it from the other way, right? And seeing how big the fairway is, where the misses are, and thinking about where we want to hit it and where we want to land every shot. So, um, we worked on a lot of good stuff. What'd y'all like about today? Anything in particular? Just what you said. <laughs> seeing the hole in reverse. Thinking about it in course course management. <laughs> we don't want that. We don't want any of that. Too much um, of a hero. <laughs> John, I learned you check your ego and you check score better. Ego. Exactly. Yeah, take your medicine. That's kind of the idea there. Um, That's one of my favorite things is managing my way around a golf course because you can hit it very poorly and still score. Right? I love playing a match against a guy and you know, hitting half the number of greens as he does. Being all over the map and at the end of the day I go, yeah, I just beat you three two. It's a lot of fun because I manage myself better, right? You know, putting yourself in the right spot, taking out the trouble, that kind of stuff. So we did it out there on the practice tee and on the range and on the short game area and putting. And we kind of put it all together here today. And I hope you, you took away a lot from each of those pieces and saw how it fit to what we did today. Right. From tee to green. Right. And, again, just to harp on that, just seeing the whole backwards, it looks completely different. Not nearly as intimidating now. So, that's the biggest thing. Like I said, I wasn't going to turn you all into Adam Scott or Ricky Fowler or anybody. So, I wanted to work on how do we get those sixes and sevens and doubles and triples down. And I think we got that today. I think we really saw how it all came together. When to take our medicine, when to go for the shot, where to put ourselves, all that good stuff. So, really good. Um, favorite part of the class, of the series, anything? Pitching and chipping. Pitching and chipping. Yeah. Yeah. It's good stuff. And putting. The putting is good. Yeah, I think we really liked that tee drill that we did. Yeah. yeah. Seeing the ball go in the hole was really important. Yeah. Well, the other thing, too, is alignment. You know, you really helped my alignment with the, you know, using the, uh, the sticks and setting up my alignment as well. That was improved, and that's helped me the yeah. last three weeks as well. Yeah. That's a big thing, whether it be knowing that you're set in the right position or seeing the ball go in the hole, it's always this positive reinforcement that you're getting, this positive feedback, rather than I can't do this, or I'm not gonna do this, or I don't wanna hit it there, or let's not miss there. Instead, let's do this, let's hit it here, let's hit it like this, I'm in a good spot, now I just need to execute this. You know, that's the biggest thing. We talk ourselves into a lot of big numbers, right? Dude, I mean, it's easy to do, right? Oh, I'm on the green and five, I'm putting for bogey, and then we three putt, now we just make triple. How often do we do that? So, just talking ourselves into course managing and getting ourselves in that right position, I think, is, is key. So, good work. Great. Uh, Thank you. Appreciate it, Thanks guys. again. Yeah. You're welcome. You. Okay. All right, guys. So, when we have a million views on YouTube, it's going to be. You said you'd tell us in a second.
right. So seeing the club, the, seeing the ball go in. Seeing the ball go in at a certain spot. Really like that one. I think that drill really connects with y'all. The gate drill, where you put it. Say I want it going in at seven. I'll put a T at six and eight. And now, instead of this, this is my hole, right? So you really have to focus on a precise spot. You can have where it breaks, where it goes. Um, yeah, so that's really good. I really like putting in such a pre precise part of the game. But I really like honing it in a little bit. And instead of focusing on a vague general target or area, really bring it into a much smaller target. Right? So, um, next week we've got on course to close today. We just did a talked about swing path, We've got some good drills, the uh, gate drill for instance, we worked on swing path, uh, centeredness of contact, we worked on putting the drill behind, or the tee behind the golf ball, and where our impact really starts, everyone thinks that it's the ball, and then the, the divot's well in front of the ball, really the divot starts right there, and it gets just deeper as the ball goes, um, so we talked about a lot of good drills to work on those types of things, we talked about how our body weight, um, transfers, we talked about how path as well as weight transfer, how all these things are kind of directly related to each other. Um, and of, of course, most importantly, we talked about practice and how we bring this to the driving or to the golf course and how we work on it here prior to getting out there. And one of the biggest things that I see in a lot of uh, mid handicappers and amateurs is proper improper alignment. So that's one thing that I really wanted to focus on today was getting ourselves lined up because this is where we can work on it. So if we get ourselves lined up and we hit a bad shot, who cares? We want to make sure we're lined up every time. This is the driving range. We can focus on it a little bit more without causing pace of play issues out there. Right? So this is where I wanted to focus on. I think we got that kind of covered. Um, and that was that was really good, I think. Uh, any takeaways from today? Anything that we really liked versus anything else? Anything I think it was in terms of understanding.